So I just wanted to share that I got these pillows from Burlington. It's a pack of two. These pillows are very large and um, thought they were nice and plush, but when I got them home, I thought they were a bit too big for the couch. So I just wanna show what I did to make this work. I already made the change, but I'm just showing you here what it looks like. So taking the packaging off, I left one pillow the way the way it is here. And this one is just gonna go right in this little corner of the sectional. This one fits nicely in this space. I don't think it's too big for the corner, but I originally wanted to put one on each end and I thought they were too big for the end. But this fits nicely here. So for the second pillow, I literally cut it in half and just sewed the edge together. So now it comes out to be basically three pillows. So one pillow will go here on this end of the couch. Nicely placed against the armrest. And the second pillow will go over against this armrest. So there we have it, three pillows for the price of two. This is a little love seat we have in another room, our sitting room, and this happened to the armrest. Looks horrible. It's just continuing to peel, and it's just gonna keep peeling and peeling. We're not ready to replace this yet. The other side is fine so far. And nowhere else is that kind of damage there it's just this one arm so I have a quick solution for that and I'm just gonna show you what I'm gonna do to correct this or more like conceal it this is the fabric that I'm gonna use to cover over that messed up piece of the leather couch hide that ugly and it's mainly light brown but it has these little polka dots in there that are much darker and then kind of match so I'm gonna see what I can do with this. This is one and a half yards of fabric and I'm just gonna cut it in half. I'm gonna do the same thing to both sides even though only one side looks bad, but to match it, doing the same thing. So I'll show you that. And the last thing I have is this ottoman, this little mini ottoman footrest that goes in, in front of the little leather love seat. This thing was here when we moved to the house. The own, previous owners left it and we've been using it for the whole time. We're using it just like this. It has an indent here and here on all the little corners. It, it's a little ugly right now. So I plan to revamp this, give it a fresh look. It does have wheels on the bottom. So I'm just gonna show you how I'm gonna make this look pretty. 